Hello everyone, another string trimmer review, and this one is on the Greenworks 24 volt string trimmer. Uh, I got to test and uh, I got to test this out on the property, and I wanted to talk about the power, the battery life, uh, some of the different features, and what kind of uh, properties or people this would work for. So uh, first impressions, I do really like it. Uh, I would recommend this for probably a light duty to medium duty yard. Uh, this will cut, uh, trim grass well, and it'll trim some weeds, uh, trim around the sidewalks, will it, will it trim thick weeds? Uh, it could trim some thick weeds, but I would say this is for mostly like uh, trimming up around the house, uh, edging the beds, and that kind of thing. So it comes with this 24 volt battery here and it slips on and off. So the battery life will probably get you anywhere from 20 to 40 minutes, depending on your yard. It does have a battery indicator there. So it tells you how much uh, juice is left in the battery. It's at 24 volts, so it gives you a decent amount of power. And it is lithium, so you're gonna get all the power that the battery has, it shouldn't fade. And once it's uh, drained of power, then it'll shut off. But it shouldn't, uh, the power shouldn't fade throughout the, the life of the battery cycle. It has a safety button, so you press this and then you can turn the weed whacker on. Uh, comes with this handle and then it also has this telescopic uh, part of the pole. So you could uh, adjust the length depending on if mom's mowing, she might be a little shorter or dad or the son, one of the kids is mowing. So when my younger kids mow, I can make it smaller. If I want to put it in the trunk of my car or something like that, I can make it smaller and then I can also expand it out if I wanted to and then it locks into place. Uh, this comes with a guard that you have to put on and screw in a couple of places and comes with this, uh, it's kind of a flower guard. I'm not a big fan of these. Uh, I might even take mine off. I don't really think it's that helpful. Um, but the way you put this on is, you, it took me a little while to figure it out, but the way you put this on, you just kind of put it around the casing. You open it up and put it around the casing. Okay, some of the features. So this has an edger and trimmer combined. And I wasn't sure how that would work, but you know what, I, I actually kind of like it. It has a wheel here for the edging, so you can actually put it down and edge your sidewalks. And at first, uh, I wasn't sure if the wheel would work too well, but uh, I actually liked it. It actually works pretty good. And I, I can get a nice uh, edging line that you'll see in the video. Uh, but I liked it. This has a 12 inch cutting path. So the power of the 12 inch cutting path is decent. I wouldn't, out of a scale of one to 10, 10 being you could take it in the brush and cut down larger weeds and all that kind of stuff. I'd give it around uh, uh, seven or eight. So you're gonna be able to trim again, grass and regular weeds, but not really thick stuff without the line starting to get caught up a little bit. So again, I'd say this is kind of like a medium duty, medium duty use uh, weed whacker. Okay, so some of the features, the bottom of this trimmer transforms. So you can transform it for edging or regular weed whacking. So it gives you several different options. If I wanted to do my weed whacking, I just rotate this 90 degrees and that's set up for weed whacking, a regular grass trimming, whatever you call it. And then if I want to edge, I'll rotate this again. So then it's set up for your edging. Uh, those are the pretty much the two modes that I use. It also has some angles here where you can bend it down and adjust it if you want. I mostly found this angle the most useful for my regular trimming, like that. So pretty much the two out of, they give you several different adjustments. So I found basically two adjustments. This for a regular trimming and then turning it 90 degrees for your edging. So I wasn't sure about that at first, but I actually like the edging feature and that the adjustments. The wheel is plastic and the guard is plastic. So you're gonna have to be careful about that. Just uh, treat it gently. You don't wanna be banging that around. And it seems like it should hold up throughout time. Uh, just 
be uh, gentle with that and don't bang that around. One of the other things I really like about these battery operated string trimmers is no gas or oil to worry about, no emissions to breathe in, and you don't have to pull a string to start it up. So it's pretty much you press the button and it's good to go as long as your battery's charged. So that is a nice feature on these. So this is an auto feed head. Uh, basically has one string coming out and they have it set up where when you pull, when you first start it up and pull the button, each time it adjusts the length to come up to here and clip off. So it auto feeds, you don't have to bump feed this. And that has been working pretty good for me. To change the spool out, you press these two buttons here. And that cap comes off. And here's the spool here. It comes with an extra spool to you can either buy extra spools but i just buy extra line and then all you need to do is uh, wrap it around clockwise to re-spool it and then you just put it back through the hole you just put it back through the hole and then push the spool on and then put the cap back on so very easy to uh, replace the spool and the line and and a lot of uh, trimmers, especially in the past, it's been a pain, but uh, it's nice that these newer trimmers have uh, easy to replace spool line. So again, uh, I do like uh, this Greenworks 12 volt, a uh, good, uh, I would say medium duty grass trimmer for your property. Battery's gonna last about 20 to 40 minutes. I think it takes about 40 to 60 minutes to recharge it. You can get an extra battery if you want, if you have a bigger property and you just need a medium duty uh, grass trimmer. Another nice thing about this 24 volt lithium battery is that you can use it with a bunch of the other green work tools. So they have things like uh, blowers, hedge trimmers, pole saws, and all kinds of hand tools. They have drills, uh, a lot of different uh, options, uh, circular saw, vacuum. So. A bunch of uh, other nice tools that you can use with uh, the same battery so that's another good option with this grass trimmer here uh, but overall I think it's good quality and I think it's a uh, good build so I do I would recommend it I hope this uh, video is helpful thanks for watching
Mmm. -hmm.